Okay, good afternoon. Before riding on your converted e-bike, it is must and it is rather required to do the configuration of the motor and the controller itself through this LCD screen which is the SW900 LCD screen so to go into the configuration mode you have to press the up and down keys here for 3 seconds and this one will appear so P0 it has it is the first configuration it has 16 configurations P0 to P16 P0 indicates how much luminance is your screen so it goes from 0 to 3 or 1 to 3 rather where 1 is the lowest and 3 is the brightest okay just like that so we will have to stay at the high by this position so to go to the next configuration P2 just press the M or the menu key here it says here it is the unit of mileage there are only two selections here which is in kilometers per liter here uh, sorry kilometers per hour and the other one is miles per hour which is selection number one here in the Philippines since we are using the kilometers per hour so let's set it at zero the third one P03 is very important is how much voltage is your battery so by default it, it is set to 36 volts but here are the selections 60 48 and 36 volts depending on your motor and battery configuration mine it's set to 48 because I'm using the 48 volt battery the fourth one the P04 is the sleep time sleep time meaning how many minutes will the display going to turn off automatically so the range is from 1 to 60 minutes mine I'm using a zero meaning I don't want for the screen to put on to sleep so the next one is P05 by the way it automatically turns uh, to the next if you are not going to press any key so P05 is the pedal assist grades so there are two levels here 0 and 1 0 the level assist will only give you three levels 0 1 uh, 1 2 3 pedal assist levels while 1 gives you five grades of pedal assist the next one and the menu is the P06 is also very important which is the wheel size mine it's, it's set as to 27.5 because this is an MTB that depends on what wheel size you're going to use if you set it wrong then mileage and kilometer rating will vary or will be wrong also so might as well set it to the correct one next one uh, the next one is p07 let's go back here p07 is the speed measuring magnet range so this one i just leave it at the default which is 48 but this is uh, 
ranging from 1 to 100. Maybe this can be set as the default only. Then the next one is B008, which is the speed limit. So how much speed limit is indicated for your use? Here in the Philippines, since we don't really give any speed limit for e-bikes, so I just set it at 50 kilometers per hour. But this goes all the way to 100 kilometers per hour. So I'll just set it at 50. The next one is P09. It says here zero start and non zero start. So zero start is, I don't know, I uh, haven't tested this one, but I'll just set it to default at zero. The next one is P010, which is the driving mode. Here you, you, you can select whether you're going to use only pedal assist or you're going to use throttle only or both. So the setting is 0, 1, and 2. So 0 is pedal assist only, meaning throttle is useless at this mode. The next one is 1, which is throttle only which means pedal assist is useless if you set it to this one. The next one is 2, which is pedal assist and throttle, so both. Since mine, I don't use the throttle, so I just set it at 0, because I'm only using pedal assist. P11 is the pedal assist sensitivity range. It ranges from 1 to 24 so this one sets how much uh, sensi sen sensitivity is for the pedal assist sensor mine I set it at 10 because I don't want the motor to kick in every time I use my pedal assist so the higher the better so let's go to Pedal as uh, P zero twelve. Okay, here P zero twelve means the si the strength of the pedal assist. So how much strength is the pedal assist you're going to give to you while using the e bike? So mine I set it at one. By the way, the range is from. 0 to 5. So you can play along with this one, maybe. The next one is P13. This one is the magnet size of your pedal assist or how much or how many magnets are installed in your pedal assist center. Mine is 8 magnets so it is set at 8. The next one is P14. It is the current limiting of the controller. Current meaning how much how much uh, amperage is the controller will be giving to the motor while using this one. Mine it set it at 10, but the range is from 1 to 20 amperes. The higher amperage is the higher battery usage. Okay. Next one is P15 which is currently not used at this time or this one P15 I just set it at default anyway it's not used the next one is P16 P16 resets your odometer so mine is stating it's 62 kilometers already so Let's try to reset this one by holding the up button for 5 seconds. Okay, let's try. Okay, it's now reset to 0. Okay, 
that's it so that's the 16 modes for the LCD controller configuration I will just uh, link the description below on the file um, so that you can download the configuration for this one so P01 which is the brightest I'll just set it to the lowest so that it will not consume much more of the battery okay thank you